Sure. One, one, one. Hey, Vike fans, Berserker88 here on what's going to be more than likely the last reaction to action of the season. Last Viking game was played at TFC Bank Stadium today. It was cold. It was outside. It was old school Viking football. Everything was great except the end. About the game. Seattle kicks off and Patterson returns it to the 12. Eh. Pearson loses a yard and then Teddy hits Wallace for 10 yards. Pearson then gets two on first down after dodging Michael Bennett, who ran past Matt Khalil. <laughs> then Teddy hits Diggs for nine. After two incomplete passes, Teddy throws a short five-yard route to Wright on third and ten, and Wright gains nine. Fourth and one, and then balls on R48. We go for it. Teddy sneaks. Oh, we're up on a secret mission. We've got us a secret plan. Secret, secret, hush, hush, hush. Secret, secret. Oh, we're up on a secret mission. Nixon gets it. But the Vikings are forced into a punt. After the next three plays, the punt travels 23 yards. The D forces Seattle into a three and out. They fumble the snap on the punt and try to run for the first down. They did not make it. We get the ball on their 29. Vikings move the ball to their 7, and it's first and goal. But we have to settle for a field goal try after zero attempts into the end zone. Why, Norv? Field goal is good. 0-3 Vikings at the end of the first quarter. Seattle doesn't do much and punt for 27 yards or 26 yards. Vikings execute a 3 and out and lock punts for 34 yards. Seattle moves the ball down to our 30 and go for it on a 4th and 13. What? Vikings D stop them. Vikings ball, R23. Pearson goes for 13. Pruitt takes a short pass for 18 yards before the drive stalls and it's another punt, 36 yards. Seahawks start at their 14 and move the ball with the aid of a 41-yard pass interference call against Rhodes to the Vikings 38 before they have to punt. Halftime, 0-3 Vikings. Seattle gets the ball to start the second half, and they start at their 20. They move the ball down to our 40 before Waynes picks off Wilson. Waynes World, Waynes World, party time, excellent! And then he returns it to uh, their 46. Short pass to line for 11, plus a roughing call for 15, moves the ball down to the 29 of Seattle. This looked good. Vikings move the ball two yards in three plays before settling for another field goal try. It's good. 0-6 Vikings. Our D forces another 3 and out, and there's a horse collar tackle on their return. Add 15 yards for that return, and the Vikings start at Seattle 48. Once again, good field position. Vikings settle for another 3 after moving the ball 19 yards in 8 plays. It's good. 0-9 Vikings at the start of the 4th. Seattle starts this drive at their 20 and use a broken play to move the ball 35 yards down to our 4-yard line. What the f*** was that? That broken play was just one of those things, I guess. Only uh, Vikings, right? Two plays later, it's a touchdown, Seattle. 7-9 Vikings. Vikings get the ball. It's a short pass to Peterson for five. Another short pass to Peterson for eight yards, but he fumbles the ball. Fuck. At the 40-yard line, Seattle's ball. R40. They move the ball 12 yards in six plays and try a field goal. It's good. 10-9 Seattle. Passion returns at 34 yards and we start at our 32-yard line. Pearson for one. Teddy is sacked for a negative nine. Short pass to Matt Asiata and he takes it for 13, but it's not enough. Punt. 32-yard punt. D forces a three and out and Ryan punts at 41 yards back to our 19-yard line. In five plays, the Vikings move the ball seven yards. Punt. 47 yards this time. Locke got a good one. The D forces another three and out, and Ryan punts it 41 yards back to R39. Minute 42 left in the game and or season. Teddy, incomplete pass. Teddy throws another incomplete pass to Rudy, but the defender is flagged for pass interference, and the ball is moved to Seattle's 42. Teddy throws a short pass to Rudy, and he takes it down to their 18-yard line. Three runs by Peterson. 
and the Vikings are lining up for a 27-yard field goal, and the Viking fans are... It's not going to make it. It's wide left. It's no good! It's wide left! It's wide left! Season over. What a gross way to end a great season. 11-5, and NFC North champions, and we get to deal with this for the offseason. But I'm looking at it as next season up, just like next man up, next season up. When I started this one, I said it may be the last one of the season. I still have to do the recap for the Packer game last week. Time got away from me this week. You know, time got away from me, and I couldn't get it done. So I'll still get that one done. And I may do one for, like, the draft and so forth. And uh, thanks for watching these. It's been fun doing them. Thanks for subscribing. And if you have any comments, let me hear about them. Thanks. I'm Berserker88. Skull Vikings. Kitty, not now. The Seahawks kick off. <laughs> That's my cat falling off the chair. <laughs> <laughs>